off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why Well, today is a special video because Dana has me starting it off. So, uh, she wanted me to tell you guys about what I've been doing because I got up and got going. Made waffles, threw some laundry in, uh, prepped some packages I have to ship out. Got my hair cut. Uh, I cut it and then Dana cut it. I know people out there that know how to cut hair probably like that's pathetic, but whatever. I cared when I was a teenager and not as much anymore. I'm just glad I have a little bit of hair left. Um, so I vacuumed. We gotta vacuum some more. We're gonna go clean up the uh, kids room. Oh, what are you doing? I'm giving you laundry to take up because you forgot to bring down the basket. I'll go get the basket. No, just take it I'll out. go get the basket. I, I got a camera in my hand. I can't carry both. So oh then we're gonna God. go. If you follow me, then you can bring I'm it up. up. All right, so now we have the kids. Let me show you what the kids are doing. They are doing a good job. I know I am. Of prepare. Whoa, you guys going on. Hey, somebody's got to get out of bed, girl. She just woke up like maybe 30 minutes ago. Okay. Well, that means time to get out of bed. the camera like that, you're like, he's like a dad, it's weird. A what? A dad, and it shows. Shush. You little bum can't kick you in the bum. Okay, uh, let's clean up, because i got to come in here and vacuum, and there's a crap ton of stuff on the floor. I also just put that there. I know, you're doing good. I know. Ashley, get up. Leggings in my bed. Okay, you get it out. You have a hair curler in your bed, Ashley. All right, guys, and bring dishes down. It's fine. hair Yep. I'm little Susie. Oh. <laughs> little Susie. <laughs> little Susie. All right, guys, let's get up. Let's get going. Yeah, Ash, get up. All right, I'm grabbing a few things here. I'm going to get the uh, basket, I guess, and take that down so Dana can bring up the clothes. Um, this is the playroom, which we need the kids to clean up. It's just been kind of messy. Kaylee and her friends like to yeah. hang out here. So... Um, Anyways, come along with us. We have other errands. We've got things to do today. I think we might be going some different places. i got to make up my list. But uh, no getting on the roof. But otherwise, it'll be a good day. Come along. So I see you guys jumped right on it after you got her bed made. No, you haven't. Exactly. That's why I'm in here. <laughs> hey, wait, 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 wait. What? Don't these get hung? Did you just leave them under? These are all clean clothes. Okay, let's let's clean up here. Don't take off the sheets until we get these hung up in your closet. Okay? Maybe. I just check them. No, I'm gonna help you. I gotta turn off the camera and help you. Okay, we got this stuff picked up kind of. So now, what are you doing? You gotta be gentle with the zippers. You don't want to be breaking the zippers. Are you helping out, Charles? No, she never does. <laughs> what? Okay. Do you need help, Ash? Shut up. It's okay. Shush. What? Yeah, we're working on it. I can't do it. Stop filming me. Okay. I can't. What is she saying? Yeah. Everyone needs their best friends. Everyone. I don't know. Oh, okay. All right. Let me go ask saying. the other girl. So, yeah, uh, places to go. Yes. Love you. <laughs> De Ashley. Good old sisterly love there. Caught on camera for all to see. <laughs> Meanwhile, I've quite literally only been in the laundry room, it feels like. I am now washing um, Ashley's bed that they just showed you. Chelsea's is drying, and somehow two more loads showed up in that time frame while I was folding two other loads of laundry. So, it's never ending, which is fine. Hey Chelsea, here's a bag for garbages. It's nice having dad home on tour day, or just to get the tour day done. He's a little bit more motivating than apparently I am. They've only had me for Saturdays for the past 18 years. <laughs> so, where did the paper towels come from? You guys know yesterday that I didn't have paper towel. 
Where did the paper towels come from? There's a whole thing. Where? On the left. You mean like by the beach supplies? No, by the all your little bins with holiday stuff in it. Because remember, we couldn't put it on the one side because you didn't want it up there on top I of the just skis. Didn't, I don't think to look so over there. So we moved it over there. I know. It's fine. You just got to look harder. Okay. Yeah. Touche, that's what you'd say to us? It doesn't go over there. I would never turn around and go and look on my decor shelf for freaking toilet paper and paper towel. I'm so, sorry. Toilet so paper's I... not there. Okay, Ashley's finishing up um, her, her desk. I've gotten her cleaning it up by herself. Like I said, she is capable. But yesterday, I didn't tell you guys, in the hopes, secretly I was kind of hoping as well, that Taylor Swift did in fact drop Reputation last night, Taylor's version. I picked up Krispy Kreme donuts, not just any Krispy Kreme donuts, but black ones. So I got all black and like white. <laughs> but then it didn't happen and so, you know, now we just give it to them for fun. Okay, Ash. It's not that okay. I know, that's why I was like, you don't need to be making a big deal about this. Okay, if we open one more freaking rip, no, we're gonna look at this. I'm gonna take away the box outside. One, two, three, four. Okay, we're gonna count. There's four, so four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That can't be all, it is. Nine packages, those are fresh. They have been twisted up, they are not stale. I'm hiding the box out in the garage. You're not open a single one until those are gone. But the donuts are all black and white. These are black. They're black. This is black as I could get it. Go finish your desk. It is. Is it wipe off ready? Okay, then wipe it off. But you have been doing your tours well. I'll get your bed spread cleaned and you can put that one back on. I'm gonna get Chelsea's ready for her, okay? Okay, we are he heading out to run errands. We didn't bring the kids with us, one, because they didn't want to. Two, I stayed up late last night and then got up this morning and I am doing massive orders for Christmas and I'm going through everyone's list, adding it to cart. I'm gonna make it really easy on myself. I need to get Christmas mostly bought and on its way to me before Abby's surgery so I do not have to worry about it. Um, so I did a lot of research because sometimes kids ask for things that are like, like you know that they would like, but like let's look for either better quality or a cheaper price or whatever. So I have that going. So now I have a really good idea of what the kids want. Um, but one of those items we wanted to look at in store and see um, like just the differences of it. And then Jason needs to go and get some holiday decor and we're gonna play a game called Does Jason Know the Christmas Products? What? Because <laughs> you didn't know the tree skirt. They thought it that was hilarious funny. that you didn't it know what the funny. tree skirt was. <laughs> it was all bundled up like it was a muff, like some old muff hand muff or something. So Man, I this hate this parking lot. It's the worst. I know. I am. Um, I hate this parking lot. I don't know how many cars get dinged? I know. There. I'm gonna go clear down here to the end. But we also have. So we're, we're gonna do a little bit of Christmas shopping or at least Christmas research. Um, so we didn't necessarily want the kids to come with us. And I might do an activity with Ashley later on. Might take her to the arcade later on. By the way, we might take her to the arcade. Okay, what arcade? I'll tell you later. So um, <laughs> that was also part of her like, you guys go, you do your thing. And then maybe you can take me to the arcade later on. They're home, all of them are home today. It's Veterans Day. Um, they were gonna go to the mall with Kaylee. Um, she found out Remember, I don't know if you remember, her first pair of earrings that she got from Nahoku in Hawaii, she lost it in She did the, forgot she had it on and it got torn off on like when she was on, or something. Yeah, she was on the boat with Jacob when they were in Minnesota. Mm -hmm. Fell off, so she had one, she took it back to the store. Um, just here in town we have one at the mall. And wanted to see if we could just buy one earring. And they said we could, and they even called like the place where they make them, and they said we could. And then like days later, they called back and they were like, uh, we can't. So 
they priced out um, how much it would be to turn that one earring into a pendant because she's still it's like still the memory of getting that that's where Lahaina it was in Lahaina and Lahaina's yeah. gone and she has memories and, and it, was, it was like her graduation it was her graduation there's a lot of yeah so we wanted to hang on to that earring stud um so she wanted so that's done that's um, part of her little Christmas but she wanted to be a part of it so that's done and she can go pick that up at the mall but she was going to take Chelsea and Ashley to go do and then her boss called her um into work today so they had to they're going to go do that tomorrow and I'm just going to let them go <laughs> as much as I would love to go and like be with them I'm going to let them go and be little teenagers big sisters yeah, yeah they'll go have fun have fun with their big sister so let's go see what products he does and doesn't know should I just like challenge you it's hard enough to go into Hobby Lobby because we're going to spend at least 20 minutes just trying to check out with one item. I know. That's the worst thing. I had to check the out. The worst. I had hey, Hobby Lobby, <laughs> get some barcodes. It's called a scanner. It started in the 80s. We've had it forever. Do it. I know. They're, they're scared of barcodes. Let's go get... Uh, but I only need one thing here. I'm not going to walk around. And no, I don't need to walk around. I already have everything I want. Okay, there's no reason to play your dumb game then. <laughs> we just have to walk by them and you have to just guess what they are. Okay, folks, he found this on its own, on his own. What is it called? It's a snow blanket. Yep, but good job. Six. Oh, yay, good for me. Good <laughs> I didn't know, I didn't know where it was. For you? No, I can find things in the tools. Idea. Okay, She's I, I trust her. Idea, yeah. It's a beautiful world out there. Just don't pass on the dare. If you have the will and a moment to spare, it's a beautiful world out there. It's a beautiful world out there. All right, we quite literally struck out at Best Buy and Fred Meyer. They didn't even have SD cards, they had like a weird brand that we'd never heard before. And I'm like, I'm not getting a new brand um, of an SD card and risk having it go bad or just not knowing anything about it. So we had to find another store. <laughs> in, in the middle of all this, we took Chelsea to, oh, that was wide open, took Chelsea to her friend's house. We had to run home and get her and take her to her friend's house. They're gonna watch old Barbie movies together, which is kind of cute. Costco is a strikeout. Like, this is insane. The only, where do they even go? I need an SD card. They have printer ink, and this is the only SD card they have. This is the SanDisk. This is the brand I want. I have this in my Tesla um, as a backup um, for all the video recordings. But they normally have an entire display of SD cards. And they also usually have boxes of paper. That's what Jason's looking for. <sighs> like, anyway, like this is dumb. We found one thing. We found paper. All right, we stopped and had lunch from Costco. We went over to the little boat launch. Um, I got a Caesar salad. Not easy to eat that in the car. And he got a chicken bake. So we ate that in the car. Um, now we're at Target. And already Target is paying off. I found my graphing paper. I'm gonna find my SD card. I'm, I found soap. And I'm looking for any advent calendars. We're gonna do advent calendars a little bit different this year because Abby can't eat any of the chocolates. So because I had to do something different for her, I thought maybe it's the year that we do something different for everyone. So I'm in the Christmas section and I'm looking for anything that I could do with that. One thing Abby has definitely requested is that we still do the tradition of our gingerbread houses. We're just going to wait till she's feeling better after a week or so, maybe even like two weeks, get closer to Christmas, and then we will make our gingerbread houses. Even Jacob has asked. He's like, are we doing them? So I have to get two sets. You haven't seen Jason walking with me because he got the crappy cart. They're all crappy carts. And so he won't walk around with it. He's just sitting up front. <laughs> I'm still looking for things. All right, so <laughs> we're finally in the car to go home. 
Like we have found what we found. We are gonna go order other things online. I would, Jason just parked his car because he couldn't like handle this. The, what is it, a squeak? I don't know what it oh, is. The, the wobble. The thud, 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 thud. We made it through this light. Um, ooh, hang on. We made it through, ooh, let's hurry. All right, I thought for sure I was gonna get a massive red light and massive traffic and be stopped and be able to like talk. Um, so now we're almost home. But it's just funny because <laughs> Jason's like, oh, I have a crappy cart. I'm like, yes, this is this is the, what you get at Target. Every single time I come, I have a crappy cart. Or um, you can, do you want to take my car to go get Ash? Or you can just take mine and then we'll switch it later. I guess, yeah. Is that okay, or do you want to switch them? No, it's fine, yeah, yeah, it's good. I can handle you. But it was funny, because we were, were sitting in traffic, waiting to come home, or trying to come home, I should say, and Chelsea texted us from her friend's house, and she's like, okay, you should, you know, come and pick me up by such and such a time. And we both looked at the clock, and it's literally in less than an hour. <laughs> and we need to be there. It takes about 15 minutes to get to the house. So <laughs> he was like, what? We only get 45 minutes here at home. Gosh, I did not say that. <laughs> and I'm like, yes, this is my life. This is my life. And this, this is why this happens. Because it's exhausting. <laughs> it's exhausting sometimes. Every time it's exhausting. I don't know what is, oh, it's not in park. Park it. Okay, well, he's gonna go back and get her. I'm gonna go in and get some computer work You're done. You're the one that wanted kids. <laughs> He's joking, you guys. He's being he's being a smart aleck right now. He loves his girls. Love girl. Sometimes he loves them more than me. <laughs> he didn't even say, no, I don't, I love you. I love all of you saying He didn't even say anything. He didn't even respond. He just laughed. Okay, first of all, we're gonna ignore this elephant in the room. I'll explain this in just a second. I've been busy, um, editing a video, but also working on the kids' Christmas lists, ordering stuff for Jason for the store, getting some Christmas supplies for the store, and for here at home, I have twinkle lights coming from my um, Christmas party um, that I had to order, and I had to order. We went looking for some Christmas presents today. Can't say what they are, but we went looking for them so we could actually like kind of see them in our hands. Some presents you need to kind of see and feel and like, is this what we really want to give the kids? That kind of thing. Didn't find it in store. Actually, I found one very similar, but I, I couldn't get that one. We'll, well, anyway, you'll find out. But, um, so I had to order that as well. So I've been doing that, working on um, communicating with my little committee for this party. Um, oh, what was I gonna do? Oh. So now um, I need to actually pull out, where is it? Um, I, my next step besides getting some dinner, because it's quarter to six, is to start working on, I can't show you that, that side of the folder, because it literally has my phone number and our social security number. Um, this packet here has our information for our passports in it. I have already done most of the legwork to get our passports. We're gonna go in a few days um, we have to drive up north. One of you, Nicole, right, lives up north, gave us the idea to go to a place um, like an hour plus away from us because it's the only one that I can find within a 50 mile radius that is open on Sunday. And it's the only day of the week that we're all home. And we all have to go together. Both Jason and I have to be with each of our three kids who are not 18. And we want Kaylee to have one at the same time as them so that they're all on the same schedule. But when I was looking at the location that we're gonna go to, making sure the hours were correct for when we were gonna go, um, I realized that I don't, may not have everything printed out or photocopied. You have to have, for the children under 18, you have to have each parent's driver's license photocopied for each kid. So me, mine and his for Abby, mine and his for Chelsea, mine and his for Ashley. This is so annoying. So I had to go through um, tonight and make sure we have everything. I don't even believe I have Jason's driver's license photocopied for each of these, because um, he's gonna go to work tomorrow, but we need this bright and early Sunday morning after church 
to go ahead and go and get these all done because it's, I think they said a 10 to 15 week um, time frame to get them back. Actually like seven to 15 weeks they said, ten, seven to 10 maybe. Um, but we only have like 18 to 20 weeks until we go to, to Japan. And so I can't, we're already feeling like, oh, we gotta get these done just in case we're on the very long end of the waiting period for our passports. So that's my next step. I might even turn on a little movie on my um, computer here um, and watch that while I work on the passports. But this little thing, this is my airport blanket. And my children made fun of me for this blanket. And now it's like the cozy blanket of the day because if you remember, it snaps at the neck right back there. So it drapes over my shoulders, keeps my front all warm and I'm sitting here at my desk wait it gets better and I preface, preface this for anyone who works from home anyone who does a lot of computer work or maybe crafting at their desks or like sitting on the couch and you want to stay all bundled up and have a snack you don't want the blanket to get all messed up it snaps onto your neck it stays on your shoulders yes I'm getting old I, I, I it's fine so you know that it has a little zipper pouch which I don't need here at home it actually came in quite handy on the airplane. I can't find the other side of the zipper. Right there. There's the zipper. So I could carry things in the pouch if I'm walking around the house, but I don't need to. But then this is the best part. There's feet. This is my human ver my adult version of a um, cozy onesie. Because now my feet stay somewhat warm. I have another solution coming in the mail. My feet get really cold when I'm sitting here working at my desk. I end up usually putting... A blanket down here to cover my feet. What's that blinking back there? Oh, it's my plug. Um, I usually put a blanket right here. Um, <laughs> my little feet. Um, but I have another solution coming, and it's kind of funny and quirky. But my feet get so cold sitting here working on um, my computer, and I do a lot of work here. Um, I do need to start getting on the treadmill there more often when I am working, but, but a lot of this stuff I can't do um, when I'm working on a treadmill. So anyway, we're gonna go find something to eat and then I'll come back to working on this kind of stuff. We did not end up taking Ashley to um, like an arcade, a little play place, because she couldn't find a great friend to go with. They either went out of town, one was sick, one had a regular sports game, I can't remember what sport, to go to and I'm like on a Friday night I thought that was weird so we didn't end up taking her so 